Adding items to cart comes in two options. It is either you are adding the items to your cart to buy or purchase later, or you want to add the items and buy instantly. In this video, I'm going to walk you through just adding items to your cart and buying them or paying for them later. However, before you think of adding an item to your 1688 account cart, you might have sourced for the product quality and or the credibility and reliability of the supplier before you make the move of adding the items to cart and thinking of purchasing it. This very item is an item that I have already ascertained the credibility and reliability of the supplier and the quality of the product. A classical example is reading the reviews. It has 1,200 plus reviews, just as you can see. So then the next thing also is you consider other things as far as sourcing for quality product is concerned. If you haven't watched my video on how to ascertain product quality on 1688, I'll leave it in the description of this video so that you will go and have a look at it on how to ascertain product quality on 1688. Let's dive into the practical aspect of adding items to your cart. When you, you have sourced for the item and you get to the interface, just as you can see mine, from this interface, this very part means add to cut and this part means you are buying the items instantly you want to buy or place the order instantly without necessarily adding it to your 1688 cart and order them later hour notwithstanding that too if you want to best understand these two options, you can either use your high dictionary or your high translate to translate and understand what it means. So let me quickly translate this and see. You see, add in the bill. In other words, add to cut. Let's translate the other one and have a look. Order immediately as simple as a b c d order immediately the distinction is very clear so in my case for instance i'm interested in adding this very item to my cart and pay them or order them or place the order later hour so what i will be doing here is to click at this very part so i tap there it brings me to this interface these are various um, items, probably with colors. So it's a green, purple. So these are various colors as far as the very item I want to add to my cart is concerned. So I'm interested in adding 70 pieces. So I, what I would do is to select the colors that I would like to um, add to my cart and order them later hour. So for instance, this one, for instance, let me say I want, um, okay, let me say 15 pieces. This one also 15. Then 15 pieces also. So I'm just missing the colors and 15 pieces of this or probably 10, 10 of these as well, and well, 5 of these, to make 70, a total of 70 pieces. Let me explain something to you here. Now, when, you, after adding the, uh, the number of items that you would like to add to your card, just as I have demonstrated, this place will tell you the quantity of items that you you have um, entered, then this place will tell you the sum total 
of the, um, uh, the total uh, number of items that you would like to add to your cart. This sum total excludes the cost of delivery, from the cost of delivery that is from the supplier's warehouse to your shipping agency's warehouse. Bear in mind. Having understood this, and you want to proceed to adding these items to your cart, what you would have to do is to click on this very part with the orange background to add to cart. So let me tap there. You see that a pop-up came, which implies that the items has been successfully added to, to cart. How do we know? So we go back to home page, the 1688 home page. Now, sometimes when you are on the 1688, sometimes this interface will come. It basically means you would have to log in to your 1688 again, probably for security reasons. So when you are presented with this interface and you have created your 1688 account through the Alipay account, all what you would have to do is to click and check this just as I have done. And the next thing is to click here to log you in. So I tap there. So you could see it is logging in. I then click on login. So I've been logged into successfully and I'm brought back to the home page of the 1688 mobile app. If you are on this very interface, this part, this is me. This side is cut. That is where items that you have added it to your cart and you would like to order them later hour will be shown to you. And this side is message. And this very part, sorry. This very part is um, the home home page of the 1688. And as well, this very part is um, tips or recommended apps or or uh, things that are on promotion or recommended items that are on the 1688 app. However, we are not going to make use of this, but our focus is to go and check our cart. So I then click on cart. This is my cart. In my case, for instance, I already have items that I've added it to my cart so that I don't um, get the links misplaced. So I scroll up. So whatever you have added recently will be at the very top. So in my case, for instance, the recent thing we have added as far as this tutorial is concerned is this very item. So this is the perks that we've added. And remember, we've added 15, 15, then it will state everything for you successfully. So when you scroll down also, if it is your first time adding something to your 1688 cart, it will be the only thing in your cart. However, if you have added multiple things, you see them just as you are seeing my, in my cart. So if you would want to place an order for these very items, let's take it a later hour, you are ready to place an order for these items. All what you would have to do is to select the item. Here is it, if it is this that you want to. The same way, if you want to order for multiple items from your cart, all what you do is to, let's assume I want to buy the first one, so I select the first one. So you see that it has selected it. So take a look at something. So when you click here, this very, you check this very, it means that all the items in your cart, you want to order for them. But that is not what we would want to do. So what we would want to do is to just select a few of the things from, from cart, from the cart, and we would want to place order for them. So maybe I want the pegs, so I check the pegs. So you realize that it is only the items under the pegs that has been marked, excluding the other ones. Probably I'm interested in ordering for this very one also. So what I would have to do is to mark this. So you see that it has been added successfully. So it means you want to order them from multiple suppliers. 
different and pay for them as a go so when you are done you just click on this very part to proceed and go and make the payment however our focus for today is just learning how to add items to cart successfully in the next tutorial i'll demonstrate to you how to place a successful order on 1688 without any hassle if you are finding value in this very tutorial i'll plead with you to hit on the subscribe button turn on the notification bell share this video and stay updated for more insights you can check in the description of, of this video if you would like to join me on my premium class on telegram and you can check in the description for more tutorial see you